Welcome to GTV. Today I will be demonstrating a signal start cycle timer function using IDEX RTE series timer relays. For signal start timer relays, an input signal is required to operate the timer. Wiring installation and troubleshooting of electronic components such as electronic timers should only be performed by a qualified electrician when the power is off. Adjustments to the timer range or operation should be made when the timer's power is off to prevent malfunction. For test purposes, this demo box will display the cycle function in real time. This RTE P2 or B2 timer can perform six different timing functions including the cycle signal start mode, which can be selected by this dial here. The cycle signal start mode is selection B and C. Selection B is cycle with off first and selection C is cycle with on first. I can set the time scale with the dial here up to 60. The third dial sets the range of the scale to seconds, minutes, hours, or tens of hours. With the RTE relay, the timer range can be set from 0.1 seconds to 600 hours. For the demo here, I will use the cycle off first to demonstrate the cycle function and set the timer to 10 seconds. The counter here will show the time displayed. The button here will supply an input signal for the timer to begin. When the start input is supplied, the timer will begin and the relay contacts will remain in the off state. The application will remain off until the preset time elapses. Once my counter hits zero, the relay contacts will transfer to the on state and remain in the on state until the set time elapses. The set timer for both the on state and off state is the same. An example of a cycle timer function could be a flashing light in a hazardous location where the light flashes between the on and off state for a set duration. To find out more about different timer relay functions, check out our other videos at GTV. IDEX RTE series timer relays along with thousands of other products and services are available at Gelco.com.